everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be unboxing the Degusta box for February 2019. Degusta box is a snack subscription box and food subscription box where they send you different snacks and food every month. It retails for $19.99 and then they have tax on top of it. So I think it's like $21.05 for me. Um, so typically these come pretty early. It's obviously it's before February. So they shipped it out really early. Last month I had some shipping issues so I didn't get it till towards the end of the month. So this does feel very back to back for me because I feel like I just unbox this, but typically it does come at the very beginning of the month. It's usually one of the first boxes that I get. I will leave a link down below if you're interested in signing up. I don't think that they have any discount codes anymore. I think they ended their referral program, but I will leave a link down below if you're interested in signing up. If you're new to my channel, I do lots of different unboxings here from food to beauty, home decor, fashion, bath boxes, and everything in between. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the box. So when you open it, there is always just brown paper and a sticker that says, open me, eat me, enjoy me. And then that's what it looks like. There's some pamphlets on top and then the goodies. So I think this month, um, they usually have like a theme, but they don't title the theme, but I think this is kind of based around the Super Bowl. Um, and then it has a little thing on Manitou truffle Parmesan, grilled chicken, so like seasonings. And then they usually have a recipe on the back for one of the things in the box. So let's go ahead and get in. So the first thing I'm pulling out are popcorners and the, these are the spicy queso flavor. I love popcorners. My favorite flavor is, I think the kettle corn is really, really good. And it says um, it's $3.29 for a seven ounce bag. Obviously this is not a seven ounce bag. It's a one ounce bag. So, um, but these will be really yummy to try. And it's always packaged pretty well. The next thing that I am pulling out, and there are three of these, these are classic guacamole quick mixes. Yeah, there's three of these. And they are $1.19 each. Um, so you mix it with two avocados and you're ready to party. So what's in it? I'm just curious. Maltodextrin, salt, garlic powder, onion, ascorbic acid, milk sour, cream powder, red bell pepper, buttermilk, citric acid, lime. Okay, so I guess this gives it flavor without having to do all the stuff on your own, like adding lime and, and onion and things like that. So that three is a lot and I, I'm excited to try that out. I do have an avocado in my fridge that I need to use, but I think I only have one. So maybe I'll just use half a packet with one of these, but these are cool. Um, the next thing I'm seeing, I'm gonna eat right after this video. And these are the sourdough craft beer pretzel rings. Um, they retail for $3.29. I don't drink alcohol, so I don't care about the beer part, but I love pretzels. I love sourdough pretzels, and um, I cannot wait. I've been like craving something salty today, so this is probably gonna be part of my dinner. I always eat really bad after I open my degusta box. I don't know what my problem is. Um, the next thing that I am pulling out looks like it is the Manitou Trading Company, one of the seasonings, and this is the um, truffle parmesan and black garlic seasoning. So let's see. This unique seasoning is an indulgent blend of umami rich ingredients combining the robust flavor and aroma of black truffles with rich parmesan cheese and a subtly sweet yet savory black garlic. Used to, used to add rich savory flavor to roasted meats, tossed with fried or roasted potatoes, or add to risottos or creamy pasta dishes. Cool. I'm excited to try that. I am having pasta tonight. Pasta and pretzels, I know. I really sound like a very nutritious person. Um, I'll have pasta for dinner and then I'll have the pretzels after. Um, while I watch TV or something. But maybe I'll use this. I'm not sure. I, this, I need to like smell it, but I don't really want to open it yet because I don't know if I want to use it yet. All right. And the next thing that I am pulling out... Oh my god. This is, okay, I thought that this was a real taco shell and I was like, I do not know how that did not shatter and break in transit because you can't even take a bite without the whole thing crumbling to pieces. It is a candy taco soft candy mix. Oh my gosh, that is so fun. Um, and this is, retails for $4.99. Oh, I, let me just say that I love gummies and gummy bears and like those kind of candies. This doesn't look like, like super high quality gummies, but, um, I don't know if you can see. Oh my god, I'm like so excited about that. And I think it's by Raindrops? Yeah, it's rain, Raindrops. Okay, cool. 
has two grams of protein, 16 grams of sugar, but there's four servings, so there's way more sugar than 16 grams, but excited about that. Then from Bean Smash, there are two different snack or dip things. One is a chipotle black bean and the other one is cheesy pinto bean. You microwave them for 60 seconds. Um, you read about these. They retail for $1.49 each. Bean Smash is a warm and tasty protein packed bean dip or snack that is available in four great flavors. Each cup contains at least 10 grams of protein, is gluten free, vegetarian, and non GMO. It is convenient and easy to prepare, just add water, heat, and eat. I usually don't have chips and like crackers in my house, so I probably will eat these as a snack, but I don't know if that's gonna be gross or not yet. We'll see, I might just have to buy some chips. All right. The next thing that I am pulling out, oh, it's another thing from Manitour Trading Company, and this is their Piri Piri sauce starter, um, and retails for $2.99. So Piri Piri is Swahili for pepper pepper. Um, so yeah, you can grill or bake poultry or delicious signature ingredients, pasta, pasta sauces, dressings, aioli, soups, stews, and more. Cool. I love getting like, what's really cool about this box is you get like seasonings or things that you can use in meals, not just snacks, um, which is nice because it kind of inspires you to do something different. Like I would probably never um, do something with Piri Piri um, on my own unless I got it in one of my spice subscriptions, but um, I'm excited to use that. It looks like there are two different things left. So the first of the last are these three PB Fit peanut butter powder. Um, it says vegan gluten-free protein. So I'm guessing this is a protein powder. Um, so it's $5.99 for, eight, for eight ounces, and there are 0.84 ounces in each one of these. So let's see what it says. PB Fit, and this is the product of the month. So PB Fit is everything you love about peanut butter made better. Whole roasted peanuts pressed to perfection means PB Fit contains up to 90% less fat than traditional peanut butter and around a third the calories. Great in smoothies, shakes, baking, and more. Okay, so never mind. It's not a protein powder, but it's like the peanut butter that you make yourself in a way. Um, that you mix with water. Cool. I know my sister is probably going to steal these from me, but um, that's kind of fun. I usually don't eat a whole lot of peanut butter just because I forget that peanut butter exists. <laughs> but this will be fun to try. And the last thing is from Emmy's Organics. Um, and this is their coconut vanilla bean, no, coconut cookies and vanilla bean. And this retails for $2.49. So they are just like ground almond cookies and they say they go really well with a hot beverage. So this was a really interesting mix of products this month. I definitely see like the football um, theme. Oh, if you want a coupon code off of Emmy's Organics, which is for this, um, use code Degusta30 at checkout. You can use that if you want. Sorry, I got sidetracked. I saw like a business card thing in there, so I pulled it out. Cool. I think that this was great. I feel like, so for me, I personally shop at Lidl for my regular groceries because if I go to a bigger store like Kroger, I just, there's too much stuff. I start to buy stuff that I don't need because I'm like, oh, oh, what's that? What's this? What's that? So I go to Lidl because they are very basic and very simple. I know they don't have Lidl's all over the United States. So if you're not sure what that is, Google it. It is a German grocery store that they have here, similar to Aldi, but I personally think is better than Aldi. Um, so it is nice to get this box because they don't sell a lot of on-brand stuff at Lidl, at least, and if they do, it's usually pretty expensive. So I usually buy knockoff brand stuff. So it's really fun to be, tr be able to try new different things. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're interested in signing for the box, signing up for the box, I will leave the link down below and I'll see you in my next video.